This $25 million estate in Boca Raton is the family home of billionaire John Henry, owner of the Boston Globe, England's Liverpool Football Club, and the Boston Red Sox. It's the perfect compound for a family that values privacy, security, and the ultimate in South Florida lifestyle. The first thing you see is this magnificent sun-soaked great room, which features 30-foot ceilings and just an open, airy space. Mr. Henry's passion for collecting Japanese antiques and artwork is evident throughout the 41,000 square foot residence. The mogul even commissioned an artist to hand paint this bathroom. Steps Away is a space architecturally designed to feature the sun. It's called the Sunset Room. And Mr. Henry is said to have closed some very big business deals here. The billionaire's penchant for music can be seen in the state-of-the-art recording studio he had built. He also loves pizza. He built an Italian-themed dining area around this brick oven. One level up, just past the master suite, is the Red Sox owner's pride and joy, his World Champion Sports Bar. Decorated with World Series trophies, platinum baseball bats, and golden gloves. This is the first and last time cameras will ever get to see this. Mr. Henry's broker, Sonata Ajim, says after our shoot, the family moved all of it into a vault. The home was custom built for the family in the 1990s as there are full-time residents. But today, the Henrys are ready to move on. The family is listing the estate for $25 million. And in case you're wondering... Sorry to all of you baseball fans out there. The Red Sox memorabilia is not included. I'm sure he would throw in a baseball or two to the buyer of $25 million house. Now, Henry has been an astute investor he started his career selling, trading soybeans and became a billionaire as a commodities trader. He bought the Red Sox in 2002 for $380 million. Today, they're worth about $3 billion. Wow. If he sells that house for $25 million, will he have done as well in terms of percentage gains? Uh, probably as well or even slightly better than the Red Sox because he bought that back in the late 80s, early 90s, uh -huh. and that part of Boca was not that popular. Now he's in a community that's very hot. So $25 million is a lot for non-oceanfront, but he might get it. Wow, he's got the Midas touch then. Exactly. He's got everything, including the Red Sox. <laughs> including the Red Sox.